My dream was always to become an actress. I think this passion surfaced when I realized how entertaining a person could be on such a small screen. But it would be hard for me. I'm at such a disadvantage compared to those around me. Yes, I believe in myself, but do others believe that an Asian American can make it to the big leagues? Well, that I don't know. This world is so revolved around the bias of one group that what if a person is genuinely good, but they don't have connections like others do? It's kind of like everyone just follows what they know or follows the trend. I want to see beautiful diversity and change. It'll be a long journey, but I know that when I succeed, I will not only be representing my community, but I will also be accomplishing my dream and making others happy. In the entertainment industry, I wish to pursue acting and filmmaking. For as long as I remember, I was always a kid that loved movies way too much. The passion for it surfaced in middle school when I started to learn more about the certain techniques it took in acting and filmmaking. I don't really think I have a fair advantage in the world today. It is simply because I'm an Asian American. Only now have we started realizing the absence of Asians in movies and overall in the industry. And it's steadily developing, but that doesn't change that it's still not as easy for me to succeed as others. My environment has always been culturally diverse. I've grown up with kids of different races and ethnicities and it has influenced me greatly. The diversity in everyone taught me to see people as equals and open up to anything different because I knew that everyone was different in their own way. In the entertainment industry, I have a few passions to follow. First of all, I'd like to pursue acting, of course, and directing. But I also like the game industry in which I'd like to create a game and be a game designer. I think it all started when my mom said I'll be a good actor because I'd always play with my imagination, create my own scenarios with sticks and toys like any other kid, but instead of just playing games with other kids, I always create my own worlds. And even in class, I, I would daydream and create different worlds and then act them out on the playground. I definitely think compared to my younger self that I do not have a fair advantage in succeeding in the entertainment industry because I am way higher in succeeding than I used to be. The experience I acquired and the knowledge I learned cannot compare to how oblivious I was when I was a child. I really want to become a major influence in the entertainment industry. I want to add art back into movies and stories and emotions back into film. I also want to add passion back into game development where people actually cared about what they made and how they made it. From my roots, my base environment was really confusing because society filled my mind with achieving what I want and reaching the sky. The media didn't, didn't diminish that idea either. Growing up, I was surrounded by movies and music, and that exposed me to the wonders of creativity and art. Plus, I was an avid reader. I'd read book after book after book, longing to take part in the fantasy world created by authors. My imagination would run so wild that I began to make up my own stories and act them out either by myself or with my sister. I think that's why I knew I wanted to make movies from such a young age. However, I was naive to how hard it is to succeed in the entertainment industry, especially if you have a unique background or heritage. Compared to when I was a kid, I believe that persons of color don't have the same advantages compared to others. It took me growing up to realize that Latinx people were either not included or inaccurately represented in movies and television. Now as I'm older and more educated on the world around me, taking part in active change is one of my biggest drives as I'm pursuing a career as a filmmaker. I was lucky to grow up with parents who told me I can achieve what I want as long as I work for it. So as hard as it will be, I'm going to give my all to represent younger kids who long to see someone like them on screen. The world is constantly changing over time, but it is because we are actively taking part in said change. The point isn't to get rid of what has already made entertainment amazing, but rather to push the boundaries and make a permanent change that accurately represents the world around us. I'm Tiffany Chung. I'm Jonathan Thurston. And I'm Michelle Cantu. And we'll see you in the future.